Okay, so Adam, um, so you've been coming to martial arts for a little while now, or your or your child has. Yep. Yeah. Yep. Both okay. Of us. Both of you. Okay. Can you tell me a little bit about your experience that you've had so far? That well, was great. Um, yeah. Trig was uh, my son was doing pretty good in school, but he was a little trouble focused and paying okay. attention. I mean, he had nothing bad, but since he started here, they have these this clip up program. Okay. And like. They have green is normal, then blue, then purple, then pink. And once they get pink, they get punches. And if they stay on purple all day, they get punches as well. Hmm. Well, Trig, for the school year before he started, he had two total. Okay. And then he started here, and he got a punch, like, almost every day. Like, he's already gotten 11. He's already done more in, like, three like three weeks of being here than he did the entire school time before that. Wow. So, okay. Yeah. That's awesome. So he's seen improvements with his behavior at school. And oh, his, yeah. Okay. Awesome. Oh, yeah, very, good. very good. So why did you originally get him involved? Was that why? Did you help him? That, with... that was one of the things like um, me, my brothers and stuff, my, my oldest brother is the only one who got to do martial arts when we were younger. Okay. And he's the one that, like we all did good in life, but he like right from school, straight A student. Yeah. Uh, um, He's a doc, he got his doctorate's degree early wow. and, and mm. stuff like that. And I know I'm still in college. I'm okay. doing great in college. I'm yeah. 4.0, but I'm wow. 37. Sure. It took me a while to get to that point mm-hmm. where he's the one that was was right on from the start. Like okay. In the military and all that before. I, okay. So you feel like martial arts gave him a little bit of an advantage. Right. Yeah. Right. Okay. I got yeah. you. Okay. Yeah. So how about yourself? So why did you, why did you want to get involved with martial arts yourself? Um... Now that I'm getting older, it's it's a lot of it's fitness. Okay. Um, I I just in, my son's here, and I wanted to do something. I know I would. It's easier to come if he's here, and I'm already bringing him here. My yeah. class starts after his. I'm like, yeah. it'll be easier to do it. I've I've with college, and then my work. I'm working like sixty to seventy two hours a week. Wow. So, and then I'm going to college. And it's like, I don't have any wow. time. But, yeah. I'm already here. I can't say, well, I got to drive there, drive back. All that's out of the way. I'm already yeah. have to be here. <laughs> so sure, sure. Now I can like focus on it. I, I think that just helps a lot and it gives martial arts a structure and like sure. the fitness. And then I like the, the, the martial aspect, I guess yeah. you should say too. Yeah. I still, sure. I like to spar. I like to roll around. Okay. So. Awesome. So, so what's the what's the, the the atmosphere that you found in the classes with with our school here in Midland with Cousins Martial Arts? What what, what are the classes like? Really friendly. That's yeah. that's one of the things I I noticed right away. Really friendly and respectful, and everybody's like like a family atmosphere, yeah. I guess you'd call it. So it's mm-hmm. it's really everybody's easy going, everybody's easy to get along with. There's no there's no like anger. There's no like I mean there's the competition is everybody's trying to make everybody do better. Mm. It's it's not like the big egos. Yeah, yeah, no, yeah. <laughs> yeah. I got you. Okay, okay, cool. So, would you recommend like for other families similar to yours to get involved in uh, with cousins martial arts? Oh, absolutely. Yeah, absolutely. Yeah. Okay. Perfect. Yeah. Perfect. Okay. All right, Adam. Well, hey, thank you for sharing your experience with us. I appreciate it. I'm sure everybody else out there in uh, social media land will too. All right. Thanks. <laughs> thanks.